playing last week and tonight? Kind of what was the biggest one? Um, I'd say really just the urgency that we had, like from the beginning of the game. Just we had a real bad taste in our mouth from last week. So from the, from the jump this week, we we made sure like we was on it. I don't feel like last week we just like started off the game with that juice we usually have, and like we made sure we we started off this week like that for sure. Patrick, let's say for you, you played safety a lot of the past few weeks, but to get a full game there, what do you feel like you showed, and how you kind of settled into that position and then worked it over? Um, I I missed a few tackles, but I overall it just. Just really being a racer, like when plays happen, uh, when you know stuff goes wrong, you just can't let it be a big game, really. So just getting the ball, just getting the ball carry on the ground, and then you know when it uh, when it's plays where I can use my instincts to make plays, you know, do that. Uh, we'll go to David. Wes, was there any concern about the fact that so many of you guys were out tonight? Um, no, nah, we uh, we practice. Uh, you know, of course, you know we love the guys we got, but you know we practice. Everybody come to work every week, so. You know, when your opportunity come, you know, you uh, you know, you come to Tennessee for a reason. So you gotta be built for these moments. And you know, I feel like I feel like we handled it uh, good without you know a lot of our guys being out. Ryan, what about for you personally? You just getting the opportunity to start and being back at home. You got a lot of people here. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I had uh, I had about ten family members uh, come to the game, so it was just cool. You know, uh, just first start of the season, be here back home, uh, at Vandy fam get to come out. It was a good feeling for sure. Wes? What's that process been like for you this season in terms of you know, not playing as much as maybe you've been used to the past couple of years and you know, the team's having more success, so maybe that's a good thing. I mean, how, mm -hmm. how much, what was it like this season trying to work your way into the team? Um, it's, really, it's really just, you know, going through it uh, day by day, you know, process. You know, you can't get down because, you know, your opportunity can come any, any, uh, any moment. So, you know, I'm just, I just really kept the same process I had since the game one. Uh, just kept going through my my weekly process of games, preparing as if I was starting the whole year. So it was there was nothing really that changed for me, honestly. Uh, a couple more for Wesley, and then we'll have D. Williams, uh, Patrick. Just you talked about not having the juice much. Like, how, how long did it take you guys to sort of move past what happened last week, and what were the conversations like with the defense? Uh, we we really knew we had to come with it this week for sure, and uh, you know. It, it was it was a bad taste in our mouth. Like usually we get the game, you know, out the way like that uh, that uh, Monday, but like you could just tell like through the week like we were still like man we we ain't come with it how we supposed to and you know I feel like that just was a reflection of what came today. Like we we went out there and played hard and played sound football and you know that's just really how we that's the expectation for us for the you know for every game. What's the Um, I feel like um, I feel like sense of urgency. I said sense of urgency because I feel like if you're not wired like as as wired as the other team is, then their scheme would work more just because they playing harder. So uh, that's really what it was. Like we weren't playing with our head on fire, with our hair on fire, and you know they was they was playing for something to prove. They wanted to prove something. And we gotta realize that we you know we gotta come with that. Uh, you know we got a target on our back, so we gotta come with that every week. Thanks, Wes. Love you.